Hi, this is Colton from WhiplashPC.com. Today we have the Exigmatech GAIA SD12 power supply, or not power supply, processor cooler. Uh, it's Phenom 4 compatible. It's also X6. It supports the i3, the i5, the i7 series, and it probably supports other Intel series processors. All Intel 775, it says. All Intel socket 1156 and 1366. All AMD socket K8, 754, 939, 940. All AMD socket AM2, AM2 Plus, AM3 CPUs. Uh, okay, so we're going to go ahead and open her up here. Alright, so I had some trouble opening it up there, so I went ahead and got it open now. Alright, as you can see, it comes with all the mounting tools and screws that it requires to come with it. The AM3, the Intel, and all that. Up here we also have another one. I'm not sure which that one's for. I believe that's for the 1366 socket, but don't take my word on that. I'm not 100% sure yet. I have to look at the manual and figure that stuff out, I guess. Comes with the fan that goes on it. it looks nice. Pretty solid looking. Feels very well built for a 120 millimeter fan. That will go on the CPU uh, cooler, as I said. I'm going to go ahead and pull the cooler out now and see what it looks like. Let's look at this first. This is the installation guide. It's basically going to show you how to install the fan and how to bolt it on to your motherboard if you have an AM3 or whatever socket that you have that will cover you up. But uh, basically, as you can see, it just shows you apply heat paste, all the good stuff. It shows you how to bolt it in, how to mount it. But that's about it for that. Uh, it shows you the warranty. This is the warranty card. And uh, here comes the beautiful. This thing is very, very big. It feels solid. It has a direct heat pipe touch, as you can see on the bottom of it. One, two, three. Feels solid. Um, once I put this on, you can just kind of imagine it being somewhere along the line of that. It looks nice. It should go in the case very nice. I'm sure it won't have a problem cooling anything. Uh, like I said, it feels solid. It has plenty of fins. As you can see through them, it's kind of nice. The heat pipe touch, I'm going to go ahead and install it, and I'll probably post a video of what it looks like installed and how it runs. So be sure to check that out. Alright, this is the inside of the case. As you can see, the fans are running. I have a Exigmatech 120mm AM3 processor cooler on it. I hey, thanks for viewing this video. If you like it, uh, go ahead and thumbs up it below and subscribe above. Thank you.